as a Bloomberg TV India exclusive then regarding really the growth sector sources indicating that a cabinet note amending the model concession agreement has been moved and the new agreement gives the new exit options really for road developers and also removes some ambiguity which is surrounding these projects. Chetan joining us for more on that. Chetan, we just heard from the revenue secretary who's talking about really easing the way for PPP projects and infrastructure projects going forward but uh, what are you picking up? Well, there is good news coming in for the developers as the Roads Ministry, after much deliberations, has taken a step forward and has moved a cabinet note seeking sole authority to amend the model concession agreement. What sources in the ministry have told us is that post-approval, the ministry will amend the MCA and come up with its own document that is likely to be called uh, Model Concession Agreement 2014. What really was the contentious issue in PPP projects with developers was the exit clause. The ministry is now planning to come up with a suitable exit clause that suits the developers. Uh, in the new MCA, developers will also be able to divest equity soon after the projects uh, get completed. The ministry will be removing grey areas in MCA to avoid unnecessary litigations and interpretations, clearly chalking out way for faster growth uh, in projects. The ministry in the new MCA will of course revise the toll fee on 1st April every year. Sources tell us that appointed date of the project will only be declared after financial clo closure is achieved. To give accountability uh, on projects, an independent engineer will be appointed to examine physical and financial progress of the project. The ministry is now looking also forward to introduce arbitration through SAROD for faster resolution of disputes. Clearly, the ministry is working hard to ease norms and regulations for developers, NHAI and state authorities for faster implementation and completion of projects.